All right, boys, you see that sign we're getting ready to roll up into. That's right, MIR for another Midnight Madness. We got the opener, boys. Let's go out here and turn some damn wind lights on. Let's go, boys. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the cab of the second gen. You know what it is. You guys seen the entrance there. We're back at MIR for another Midnight Madness running the Holly Rock shootout opener that's right boys so yeah we haven't done a whole lot in the off season but there's a reason for that one trying to get my money right and two we got bigger fish to fry coming up here soon and tonight we're just trying to turn on wind lights get consistent let's get some decent passes and let's see if we can't turn on some wind lights get to the finals and maybe win some money tonight all right boys so enjoy tonight's coverage i think it's going to be a nice one first hit of the night already completed and i can't hate on the pass i think the transmission is not loving life right now so let's go ahead and take a look at this lip all right so if you see there reaction time i need to wake the fuck up a little bit there 60 foot pretty much where i've been running based off the last few runs since last year 330 pretty much identical uh eighth mile everything's just about the same the only thing that was concerning to me was we were really riding um 2900 3000 rpms down the track so that's a little concerning um either it's not shifting correctly i mean i felt lock up come on when it's supposed to like it normally does transmission temperature no more than about a buck 20 buck 30 coming into the um pits here it, it everything seems to be fine but it just seemed like it was shifting really really late so um we'll see what it does again temperatures did drop so we'll see maybe it was just a fluke thing check fluid fluid's not burnt fluid level's fine so um let's let's get something going tonight boys later. one eternity later boys here we are about two and a half hours later and we finally get at least another hit in all right so pretty much we got ourselves a bracket truck um this thing is shifting real deep into the uh governor range right around 3k it's it's starting to shift um it felt better this pass um but we slowed down a little bit not much nothing major all right if you guys see there uh reaction time wasn't too hateful i'll take that uh 60 foot was a little bit slower 330 everything kind of dropped a little bit we went out to a 509 with a 9 and 90. but for the most part it's coming together so we're going to go ahead and i guess to the first round of eliminations and we'll see what we get Alright guys, so about another hour later, we finally get to make the last test hit of the night before we go into eliminations. I was mistaken. I thought with the time frame we were given, they were not going to give us another pass. But to say this pass, um, we put down more power, um, but we just kind of lacked a little bit in time. So we'll go ahead and take a look at it. Alright, so look at that reaction time, boys. 017, best ever. 60 foot, I just didn't get on it early enough, and that's pretty much where it all kind of steamrolled from there. But it mile per hour out the back better than what we've had previously. Went up against an old uh, OBS uh, Huey pump stuff, so kind of bummed out about not being able to take him down. But he got some power in that damn thing. So on to the first round officially. Wait, 
baby. Round one. All right, boys. Round one win, baby, on a red light. I'll take it whenever I can get them. Um, but as far as the, the slip goes, I'm going to show you guys that. So, reaction time, pretty good. 60 foot, we improved the 60 foot, the 330, the eighth. Everything went up pretty well. I let off at about the 1,000 foot just to go ahead and conserve the truck. Probably should have paid attention to the lights that were on the left side, but hey. A win's a win. Going to round two. Let's go ahead and see if we can't copy this. All right, boys, running our number all frickin' night. All night we've run the number, and here we go into the third round. Um, I did get the buy, um, but essentially it was just uh, you know, a lane choice, more or less. So we're well into midnight at this point, and on to the third round. Let me go ahead and show you guys this. All right, so reaction time. We're still awake here, boys. We're still awake. Truck ran great. Pretty much the numbers we've been running all night, and then just pretty much took the win on a breakout. So I'll take it every damn time. So here we go, on to the third round. Wish me luck. Stop right here, comment below. Do you think I'm gonna win it tonight? Leave the comment below, guys. to the finals, baby! Fuck yeah! Alright boys, you just seen the video, we're into the finals boys, slip ain't pretty, but damn it we got her done. Yeah, focus, focus, there you go, reaction time wasn't hateful, I'm not used to that uh, right lane, 2060 foot, let off at the 1000 foot. Here we go, finals baby. Dude, I almost had you. boys I did everything I could tonight everything except for hold the brake another thousands of a second and I would have had the one but I mean we really showed this truck can really do something I really do think we did but we'll take a look at the slip 
There you go, boys. That's how much a loss is. Now, we had them by a stretch. I held the brake down pretty much at 1,000 foot. Second gen brakes, what can I say? They don't hold that great. But we still walked away with a second place trophy, and I will take it. And we'll move on to the next event. And the way things are going, hell, we may have a win sooner than later. So do what you guys always do. Like, share, subscribe. P-pump the world. I'll see you guys in the next video. God damn, it's late. And before I, before I forget, before we end the video here, I just wanted to give a big shout out to my boy Derek. I, I bust his balls a lot because we race against each other a lot. But he was really in my corner tonight. He got knocked out in the first round and I guess roles reversed. So, But yeah, he really did a, a hell of a job kind of coaching me through each individual round and also was just a really big cheerleader. So big shout out to him. I'll leave his socials right here. You guys go follow him. So, yeah, just really thanks again, Derek. I really appreciate it, man.